Hey everyone, this is Mark Metternick, and here is an image that I posted to a forum and somebody noticed a very slight halo on it. So I thought I'd take the opportunity to show some of you a really super cool halo removing technique. But this technique comes out of our The Ultimate Fine Art Printmaking Workshop, where very often people use a too aggressive sharpening in their print, or in this case, web image. And so to go in there and clean up the halos really easily is a very awesome technique and very handy. So let's zoom up on the halo. It took me a while to figure out where it was, but sure enough, there is a very slight halo right here along this edge. So what this technique involves is duplicating the layer and putting it in darker color. That is the key. Then you can clone using either the clone stamp tool or you can use the healing brush using replace mode, which works just like the clone stamp tool. In this case, you take a stamp of something and you paint it in, but the cool thing about the darker color is that it will only affect pixels that get darker when you're painting. So I've taken a sample right here, right along this edge. All I have to do is move that over here and then paint. Voila, halo is completely removed. Now, if you want, you can back off the opacity and then pull it in to the amount that you feel is the most appropriate. In this case, I'm gonna pull it off by about 10% and then flatten it. Let me show you another one. Command J, put it in darker color. Come over here and only the halo disappears. Isn't that awesome business or what? Before, after, before, after. Now, a very slight amount of haloing can be useful to create the look that an image is sharper. So we don't want all halo removal. What we want is halo removal that is noticeable. Let me show you one more example. Here is an image that we use in our class to show how awesome this technique is but obviously this one has been hit with much too aggressive sharpening. So we will duplicate the layer, put it in darker color, and use the healing brush as a clone tool by using replace. And all we have to do is click, sample the blue sky, and the only pixels that are going to change are the halo pixels. Only that which darkens will change. Halo gone. Check out this and many more other techniques at markmetternick.com where I have over 12 video tutorials. All the best to you and great light to you.